right, wonderful. Hello. So I'm going to walk through really quick just some some items to um, keep in mind when you're doing chapter five in the textbook for, uh, when you're creating a uh, new QuickBook company. So from scratch, right? So what you're going to do, so I'm here on the view, um, of the virtual desktop for TVCC. So we're going to open, go ahead and open up our QuickBooks here under the applications folder there, uh, QuickBooks Premier Accountant Edition. We're in the 2019 edition, so I'm going to go ahead and close my file window here. Uh, it shows this. This is kind of the express art. What we first need to do, though, is let, let me go ahead and X out of this. And uh, we need to toggle first, so we're in the, we need to go to the Pro Edition. So down here under File, all the way down to almost the bottom, Toggle to another edition. We're going to click on QuickBooks Pro there on the bottom and click Next and then hit uh, select toggle. So what this is gonna do is it's gonna switch our edition to the pro edition. Um, and uh, so it'll shut down the one we have open and then reopen it. Takes just a, a moment here as we're doing this. One thing to remember is when this pops up, it's going to tell us that we're in the pro edition. Um, but it's still gonna say via accountant. So that's okay. Uh, the via accountant doesn't, it doesn't uh, necessarily matter. Uh, we are in the pro edition. If it says pro 2019 right up here on the top blue uh, banner, that means we're in the pro edition. So we're good to go. Okay. And so um, we can, so this is, really is the quick setup edition right here, right? That we're seeing. Um, uh, if we close this window, we're able to see our no company open um, dialog box there or, or uh, selection box um, we can go ahead and click create a new company again or we can go up to file uh, new company either way it's going to take us back to that window right that we started with uh, we're, we're going to want to do is go ahead and select then this is a little different in the book um, let's go ahead and select for myself I'm the admin so that way um, uh, that's just it gives you two options right whether you're creating really a QuickBooks file for someone else somebody else's company where they're going to be the admin and you're just uh, um, doing um, a lot of the bookkeeping work right you're not necessarily the admin for that it's really who owns the company right who's going to own and be the administrative and have administrative privileges for this QuickBooks company uh, go ahead and do for myself, right? So we're assuming that we're going to be the administrative uh, uh, admin or have administrative privileges. We're not going to go go ahead and click start setup. What we need to do is go down to this little box here on the bottom left, and we need to go to advanced setup. So that's what the uh, textbook usually has us do is go through the advanced setup, and then it'll open up a little uh, box like this for us to fill out with all the information. So you can do that if you have, as you go through the apply your skills or even the develop your skills through the chapter, uh, this is good, easy kind of box to fill out with all that information that you have there for the company. So you can go ahead and fill that out and then click next. Go on and continue to set up your company, uh, depending on the company type, what industry it's in, all that different things you're gonna set up here and you're gonna be able to um, get up uh, off to a good start with your company. So I hope this uh, video helps just with the very beginning setup as you're just getting into setting up a new company um, and toggling to pro and getting that advanced setup screen here so you can get going on it. Thanks. We'll talk to you later. Bye.